Mariska Hargitay is one of the most recognizable faces in television, having starred as Olivia Benson on NBC's hit series Law & Order SVU for nearly two decades. But did you know she's married to younger star Peter Herman? After more than 15 years together, here's what you don't know about this adorable Tinseltown couple. Meet Cute the pair met on Law & Order SVU in November 2001 when Herman debuted his recurring character, defense attorney Trevor Langan. Hargitay, who has starred on the series since 1999, attempted to break the ice with a joke, but told in style, he didn't think I was funny. The two eventually found common ground in their shared faith. Following a deep discussion about religion, Herman suggested they attend a service at his church together. As Hargitay told InStyle, I just about passed out when I saw him there. I thought, that's my husband. The SVU star told Good Housekeeping that their strong Christian faith completely set the tone for our relationship and our marriage. Wedded Bliss the pair married three years later on August 28, 2004 in Santa Barbara, California in front of 200 guests at the Unitarian Historical Chapel. The groom, then 37, told In Style, I recited my vows so loudly you could have heard them in organ. Hargitay told Good Housekeeping in 2010, I had been engaged before, but what I felt for Peter I had never felt before. It was knowing that someone else put you first and that you put him first. A lot of people have doubts on their wedding day, but I was never so sure and happy growing a family. Hargitay and Herman always wanted to have kids and got their wish when they welcomed their son, August, on June 28, 2006. Hargitay told Self, Nobody wanted to be pregnant more than me. From the moment I found out, I was wearing full-on maternity pants. My stomach was totally flat, mind you, but I was just so excited. She told TV Guide, When I first heard August's cry, that's when I lost it. You have so much love that you didn't even know about. But Hargitay was 42 at the time, and it was a difficult pregnancy. When the couple decided to further expand their family, Hargitay had trouble getting pregnant, so they turned to adoption. She told Good Housekeeping, There were wrenching moments. I say to everybody, adoption is not for the faint of heart. The couple finally adopted two children six months apart in 2011, following several heartbreaking attempts that had fallen through. In April 2011, they welcomed newborn daughter Amaya Josephine, whom Hargitay helped deliver. They then welcomed three-month-old son Andrew that October. Multilingual Family Hargitay and Herman both speak several languages, something they hope to pass on to their children. Herman explained his linguistic heritage, telling Broadway.com, I was born in New York, but I was only here for two months. My parents are German, and I grew up in Germany for my first 10 years. I still speak to my parents only in German. Hargitay doesn't speak German, but is fluent in Hungarian, Italian, and French. Location, Location, Location According to Variety, Hargitay and Herman moved their family to a newly renovated $10.7 million townhouse on the Upper West Side of Manhattan in 2012. As the New York Post reported, their Big Apple dream home has six bedrooms and nine baths, as well as has an elevator, an Eden chef's kitchen, and double-height ceilings. It also includes a sunroom with two terraces, plus a large garden with a built-in barbecue grill. Relationship Goals after more than a decade together, Hargitay and Herman are going so strong, they may only rival the likes of Hollywood it couples like Neil and David or Ellen and Portia. When a Mariska fan account posted a pic of the lip-locked couple on International Kissing Day, Herman quote tweeted the post, writing, I thought that was every day. Thanks for watching. Click the Nikki Swift icon to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Plus, check out all this cool stuff we know you'll love too.